Well, it's Sunday, October 9th, and this morning I had that buck in probably 45 yards, and I went to draw, and there's a spike buck that I couldn't see. That spike took off, and then that buck took off as well. Then, oh, it was probably an hour and a half later, Joe come around behind me and walk right here probably three yards away and come back across. I didn't get it on camera, but I was... I couldn't draw when she was right there because she was looking right at me. I didn't want to spook her away. And then by the time I did draw back, she walked out of frame and I just couldn't undraw to get it back. And the tactic came, didn't get it either, sadly. It, uh, you can kind of see it through the blind. And then when I went to A matter, it was a little too thick and you couldn't really see. But so, struggles of self film hunting, I guess. <laughs> but. A little high, hit a little high above the vitals, it looked like. Uh, but I think she went down about 50 yards over there, so. Well, the Levi Morgan series by Schwacker Broadheads got it done this morning. Uh, I was a little late getting in, and there were some deer out in the field that spooked off. Couldn't see them, but then uh, about 8 o'clock, two bucks come out, a nice one, and then a spike. I didn't see the spike, and I was drawn back on that nice one, and that's when the spike, he must have saw me, so both of them took off. And then uh, about uh, probably an hour later, here she come right behind me and worked around the blind and presented me a nice shot. So had an antlerless tag and it feels good to finally fill one this year. So here in Nebraska, we can get two buck tags. So I'm gonna try to fill both of those yet this year and we'll see what happens. Well, it feels good to finally fill a tag. I just wanna thank you guys for following along and hopefully I can get on two bucks yet this year. Be sure to head on over to drakewaterfowl.com. There's a whole new line of non-typical gear out that you guys will definitely want this fall once it starts getting cold. And uh, head on over to Tacticam as well. They got some pretty awesome cameras and their cell cams are really nice. That's what I've been running and it, you never miss a beat even when you're at work. So be sure to check those guys out.